How's it going guys? This is Tech Work Tactical and I needed a solution because I have some oddball calibers that I don't buy in bulk but I still needed to store somewhere and I didn't want to just buy a bunch of 30 cal cans. They're metal, they're heavy, and I felt like it was kind of a waste of space. So I was in my local Home Depot and I found this little Plano case for 16, 17 bucks and it's pretty big. There's the dimensions for the interior and exterior. I thought it was uh, certified as uh, water resistant or something like that, but I guess not. But uh, I couldn't really pass up on it for 16 bucks. It's a hinged two class design. So you don't have to worry about it being retained or anything like that because it's got hinges on it. It's got a four section divider. They, it can be taken out. I already tried. One thing I will say is that as since the bottom one, this one, is longer than to the other side, the build is a little dumb. And here's why. In order to section a portion of it off, it can only go this way. You can only take out this portion and make it a side by side, which is fine if that's something that you know interests you and that's what you need. But I was hoping I could have taken the middle piece out and made it this way. I don't know why, it's just something that kind of irked me and I don't really have an explanation for. That being said, it's fine for now. You can take both of them out, there's no problem. I could see some different use cases for this. Like for me, it's just probably going to be ammo storage for calibers that, like I said, I don't buy in bulk because I can't really justify that to myself. So it's probably going to end up holding my 380, my 38. Some of my more oddball stuff. After I end up, if I end up getting more of that specific caliber, then I'll change it over to a metal ammo can. Because I, since I only have a one of each, it's going to be hard to justify that. I mean, they're what? 15, 16 bucks a piece, whereas this can let me store four different things. And it was 16. It's got a rubber gasket on it. It's even got some little punch outs here for locks. It's, it's kind of hard to beat. I mean, Plano is made in America. That's always great. If I can, I will always absolutely try and, and support places that are made in America and products that are made in America. Does this fix all the problems? No. Does it definitely fix some of them? Yes. I could see this being a use case for uh, if you want to have like a little stash of stuff in your car. So if you want to take the dividers out and just put like so a couple of blankets, maybe some bottles of water, uh, like an MRE, because I know that there are stories of people that end up getting trapped in their cars because they end up crashing in a snowbank. So it'd be kind of good to have something like that just rolling around in your car, or your truck, whatever. It would be pretty good as a paperwork storage too, if like you're not worried about fire or anything like that, since it's waterproof. If you like live on a boat or anything like that, it would definitely keep out, you know, not a torrential amount of water, but certainly a decent amount of water. I could definitely see that if you if you're one of those people that needs 60 magazines for everything that you have well this is a decent way for you to section off you know different portions of your magazines really the it's again I've said this before in one of my previous videos and I forget which one it was the the, the amount of creativity of what can you do with a box is basically unlimited there's so many different things you could do with this is really limited by your creativity and nowadays the ability to Google projects, it's really unlimited. And for 16 bucks, I really couldn't help but pick one up. So thank you so much, guys. I'm gonna do a quick short on it just because shorts are doing great. Thank you for that. If you're one of the people that always looks up shorts, I do appreciate it. Now there's a chance that we can get monetized through shorts. Thank you, YouTube, doing something right. I mean, I need 10 million views, but you know what? It's easier to do with a short than a long form video. So a win is a win is a win no matter how small. Plano case, 16 bucks, Home Depot. I love that place. All right, thank you so much guys. I'll see you in the next one.